What's up guys? So this here is New Dude 167 and today what I have for you is a review on this box here which is a Mi box. It's an Android box and like I said I'm gonna do a review on it okay. I'm gonna open it up. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you exactly what comes with it and then I'm gonna hook it up and show you exactly what it's all about, what it has to offer and whether or not I like it. Alright so like I said it's the Mi box. It's 4K Ultra HD setup box. All right, all the way at the bottom are all the different, all the different apps, or a couple of the different apps. All right, we have a HDMI, okay, attach a Mi Box to TV, okay, connect, and then start streaming. Okay, on the back, guys, all right, it has Google Cast, Google Voice Search, okay, we have 4K Ultra HD, HDR, and, a, and then we have a quad-core CPU, a 3 plus 2 core GPU, all right? Then it shows you what's included, okay? It's the actual box, okay? We have the remote, HDMI cable, and then a power adapter, all right? So another thing that came with it was this right here, all right? Which is an adapter for the United States power outlet, which is really awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and open it up. So when you open it up, the first thing, the first thing I have is the actual box okay it's the actual box okay this is the front it says me on the front there okay I'm gonna turn it to the side all right so all the way from the left to the right okay we have our power okay we have a full-size USB port then we have our HDMI to hook it up to the TV and then we have our audio all right, really cool. It feels really sturdy. Then on the bottom, Mi Box tells you what the serial number is, stuff like that. All right, really, really awesome. It's really small, guys. It's really small. And it feels like it's really durable. It feels like it's really, really durable. All right, so enough of that. All right, let's go ahead and see what else there is. Okay, I open it up. We have some instructions, a couple things. Okay, and then we have... Our HDMI cable okay we have our power source all right that's why they send the adapter because this is how the power source comes that's exactly why we have an adapter and then we have our remote all right which is really awesome all right so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go hook it up and we'll start the actual review from there all right so I'm back so what I did is I connected my device, I hooked it up to Wi-Fi, I put my account information in, all right, and this is what comes up, okay? This is the first thing that's going to open up when you install your, or set up your account, everything, okay? This is the home screen, all right? So all the way to the top, you have your click to speak, and then click to type, all right? And then these are all the recommendations. Once you hook it up, it gives you this recommendation section, as well as these here. All right, Mi Box recommendations. These are a couple different apps, all right? Really awesome, really cool, okay? These here are the actual apps, okay? Google Play, Movies and TV, YouTube, Google Play Store, okay? We have a Google Play Store Music, Google Play Games, and then Live Channels all the way to the right, all right, which is really cool. I'm just gonna go into the Google Play Store really quick, really quick, okay? So, all the way to the top is our search option, okay? Okay, speak to, okay, speak to search Google Play. Oh, what's it doing? All right, so it just went off on its own. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and go with it again really quick, okay? That's kind of funny, actually, okay? Cody. Download Cody. All right, so here we are. You get all these different options, which are really nice, okay? Really cool. All right, so let's go ahead and go back. Okay, then we have our home, all right, and these are all the featured, movies at home, top paid, top free, a few options, recommendations, okay, that come as default. We have our games, which are default as well, okay, this is all the recommendations as default. A whole bunch of different options, guys. I mean, it's unreal how many different options we have. Okay, let's go ahead and go back. Okay, these are all my apps on here right now. Okay, so this is brand new. I haven't installed anything. This is everything that's default, guys. Everything default. So let's just go ahead and go back. We've seen enough of this. 
All right, and then settings, okay? We have parental controls, purchase authorization, which is really good, just in case your kids are messing around, they don't purchase anything that you don't want. All right, auto update apps, and then about. All right, so really, really cool, guys. And the search option is all the way to the top. Okay, I'm gonna go back, guys. All right, so them are all the different apps, which is really cool. Okay, then we have our settings and my, well, it'd be your Wi-Fi connection. Okay, so settings. So check this out, guys. Wi-Fi, display, Google Cast. Remember, you have Google Cast on here, which is really, really nice. Okay, we have our sounds. Even though we already have our, our volume up and down on our remote itself. All right, we have our apps. Okay, storage and reset and about. I'm going to go into storage and reset real quick. As you could see, in internal storage, total space, 5.1 gigabytes, okay? There's, I don't think that's a whole lot in my opinion. All right, but you do have a USB connection for you could put a USB drive there on the box, guys, for an, for additional additional storage. All right, and then we have factory data reset, okay? So that's how you factory data reset your device if that's what you want, okay? Okay, and on the bottom, guys, we have preferences. We have the date and time to set it up to year, to year zone, all right? We have our language, keyboard, playback settings, home screen, search, speech, and accessibility. Then all the way at the bottom, we have a, our remote, which is connected. And then if you have any accessories, guys, whether it's a different remote, maybe you have a, a remote for your games, a control for your games, whatever it is, you add your accessories. Okay, and then personal, okay, location, security, and restrictions, usage and diagnostics, Google, and then add account, all right? And by the way, though, guys, if you ever want to get a hold of me, check out this email right here. This is how you could get a hold of me, all right? But anyway, let's go back, all right? And then this is my Wi-Fi connection, all right? So, guys... This here is the Mi Box, okay? It's an Android box, guys. It's a really, really nice box. It runs really, really smooth, really, really well. All right, there's a few ups, there's a few downs, all right? I wish it came with a bit more storage, all right? It would be nice for a bit more storage, but if you throw a USB drive in there, you'll get a little bit more external storage, which is really nice, all right? The thing I like about this, though, guys, is this right here. It has the Google Store. All right, you could install Kodi, you could install Droid Admin or File Link, a whole bunch of different options as well. All right, really cool. All right, and the box itself, guys, it's really compact. You could tell it's real durable. All right, on the bottom of the box, it has like a, a rubber ring. That way it's like non-sliding, non okay? It don't slide anywhere. It'll stay put wherever it is. All right, the remote feels really nice. It works really nice. So everything about this, guys, is a really nice box, guys. If I would recommend it or not is the question, and I would definitely, I would definitely, definitely recommend this box. I'm telling you guys, this box here is really, really nice, and you won't have any complaints about it, guys. And I got this box for like 70 bucks, okay? It wasn't an expensive box, okay? But it works, guys. I'm telling you, it works. All right, but anyway, though, guys, I just wanted to show you what the Mi Box is, what it had to offer, all right? I had a lot of questions about it. A whole bunch of other people had a lot of questions about it. All right, if you have any more questions, let me know, guys. Comment. Tell me what you think. Let me know if you have any questions. I'll definitely answer them, guys. All right, but anyway, though, guys, I just wanted to do a quick overview of this Mi Box, which is an Android box, all right? And this here, like I said... All you do is you connect it, you connect your account, and this is the home page right here, guys. It's easy to set up. It took like a matter of like two or three minutes, if even that. All right, but anyway, though, guys, this was a quick review on this box. And like I said, I would definitely recommend it. And if you have any questions, make sure you comment in the comment section. All right, so if you're liking this video, guys, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure, make sure you comment and then subscribe. All right, whenever you do subscribe though guys, make sure you hit that little bell icon. That way, anytime I upload a video, it's gonna go straight to your notifications. All right, and, then, and like usual guys, if you're having any issues or problems with this box, whether you're hooking it up, installing some, whatever it is, make sure you comment in the comment section and I will definitely get back to you. 
And with that being said, guys, thanks for always supporting me, always coming to the channel to watch the videos. I really, truly, honestly appreciate it. Whether you're an existing subscriber or a new subscriber, thank you for all the support. All right, and I'll see you in the next video.